Hey guys, how you all doing? Ali here. In today's video, I'm in Glossop. What a lovely area. Haven't been to Glossop much, but it's nice around here. Uh, <laughs> in today's video, I'll be reviewing a new place called Burgerfy. Had a quick look at the menu. As the name would suggest, they've got quite a lot of burgers, some smash burgers. They've got a fried chicken spicy burger. If I ever see a spicy chicken burger on a menu, I am automatically interested. But that being said, they look like they've got a really good range of desserts as well. So I'll try and, like I always do, I'll get some burgers, I'll get some desserts. I'll try and do like a full menu breakdown for you guys. Super excited for this place. I'm hopeful for a good review. I'm hopeful for good food because I absolutely love giving you guys good recommendations. It always feels good when I go into a place they're really good. I can recommend somewhere really, really nice to you guys. But I have pretty much just made my way there. If you could, there you go. You can just about see it. So just before I do start my review, but just before I do go inside, if you guys are into food reviews, I've got a ton already on the channel. I've got a ton coming for the greater Manchester area. Please do hit that subscribe button just to say notified on my videos. And also hit the bell, hit the bell. I never asked for that because honestly, I don't really know how the bell works, but apparently you all YouTubers say hit the bell. I feel like I should say hit the, hit the, hit the bell, hit, hit the, hit the bell. <laughs> but anyway, let's get inside. Yes, having a quick look at the menu, I thought, okay, they've got on the smash burgers, they've got a normal smash patty, they've got a double smash patty, level two. Level three, they've got double smash patty with bacon, and then they've actually got a monstered up. I think I'm probably gonna get this one because I want the smash patty and I wanna try their turkey bacon as well. And then, obviously, I'm gonna get spicy chicken burger. I feel like a little bit of a spicy chicken burger connoisseur, if I'm being honest. I absolutely love them, so I'm definitely gonna get that. And then I may go for this big old thing here as well, which looks like a mix of spicy chicken and actually smash patty as well. So after trying those, I'll try and get some desserts. So I'm thinking maybe a waffle and a shake. That's kind of what I'm thinking right now. Um, waffle wise, I don't know exactly what I'm gonna get yet. I think I'll probably get something with lotus in. Um, and then on the shakes, I don't know. I'm gonna play around with it. In fact, you know what? If you wanna find out what desserts I get, you need to stay by until the end. <laughs> so inside it looks pretty cool. And they've got a nice little flower wall on the side. Menu looks good. I'm liking the look of it inside. So I've put my order in and I'm just waiting for the food to come out now. I'm super hungry. Right, okay, so food is here. I've got myself three little presents here. So, oh, and they've been kind enough actually to put on the boxes what each thing is. So we've got the bacon dub, which is a double smash patty with bacon in it, turkey bacon, I should say. We've got the MS. Mixed spicy. How did I not get that? How did I not get that? And then we've also got the actual uh, spicy chicken burger, which is called the clucking spicy. So I don't know what to go for, but I'm gonna save the one. I, I'm gonna save the spicy burger for a little bit. Let's start with let's start with actually the bacon duck. Oh, okay. This looks cool, man. This looks cool. It's a good size to it. I'm liking that. Let's unpackage this. Let's get started. This has got. Let me open it before I start describing it because I may get it wrong and then I'll just look silly. Ooh, yeah, this looks good. A couple of smash patties there, some American cheese, some turkey bacon. I think they've got some of their own burger fry sauce on a sesame seed bun as well. Hey man. That gets a definite hey man. Patties are super soft. Loving the American cheese. Even the actual turkey bacon's got just a lovely taste to it. Yes, there's some smokiness, but it's just, it's a bit meaty. A good texture to it. I'm absolutely loving this burger. Super soft, super tender, seasoned really, really well. I am happy to 100% certify this a hey man for sure. I'm gonna move on in a second, but this is absolutely delicious. A burgery parcel of just goodness. I should say, just looking at the menu quickly, you can actually meal up for two pounds, so you can get a burger and then meal up, and it's two pounds, and it's, uh, you get chips and drink with it as well. The chips are here, which I'll go over in a second. And let me just try, oh, let's try the actual spicy chicken burger. You guys know I'm a fiend for spicy chicken burgers. If I ever see one, it's gotta happen, right? Let's try it. Guys, right? I've not had a bite yet, but I'm kind of sold already. Look at this. This looks awesome. Spicy. It looks really flavorful. There's a good amount of cheese in there as well. There's a good amount of meat to bun ratio, which they've nailed. Oh, I hope it tastes good. I'm kind of sold already. <laughs> It tastes 
as good as it looks. That gets a hey man, I am loving the spice on that. There's actually a good amount of crunch still left on actually the chicken as well. So yeah, it's doused in their own made spicy sauce, but it's got a really good amount of crunch on there. The cheese works perfectly. Good amount of spice, but not too much. So not like, um, like a Philadelphia is very spicy. This has got, I would say, a really nice amount of spice. Works really well, it's a hey man, 100%. I am loving this. I feel like the bar's been set really high for the desserts now because the smash patty, fantastic. The spicy chicken burger, absolutely phenomenal. Two hey mans. But let's crack on now with actually the mixed spicy. So we've got the patty and we've actually got the spicy chicken as well. So let's crack on with this. I think it's fair to say that this is quite a big burger. Look at that, guys. We've got the spicy chicken there. We've got the patty. That looks awesome. There's no turkey bacon, but I'm sure you can add that if you wanted to. But that looks absolutely, if I can just focus my camera, come on camera, work with me. That looks phenomenal. Um, I love the first two burgers. I'm looking forward to just tucking straight into this. I am so hyped for this. <laughs> they have blown me away with the first two items. This is really a combination of the first two things. Typically, I'll get the chicken separately, the beef separately, but sometimes you just gotta get a bit of animal on animal, man. You gotta do a bit of chicken on cow, let's go for it. I didn't expect there to be extra chicken at the top there as well. There's nothing perfectly serviceable going on. There's nothing average going on here. That is absolutely phenomenal. I am loving this burger. I would suggest and invite you and employ travel for this place because I am absolutely being blown away by this, man. The spicy chicken burger, if I have to redo my top five spicy chicken burgers, this would feature. Same actually with the patty. Or not the patty, sorry, I've got a bit of a food thing. Food's gone straight to my brain. Then the same thing about the smash patty. That is fantastic. The burgers have been awesome. I'm gonna quickly nibble on a couple of chips before we start on the dessert, so don't go anywhere. So, actually, whilst I wait for my desserts, let's go for the chips. Actually, a pretty good portion of chips. Actually, there's some left in the bag as well. These are definitely more sort of fries, thinner fries, maybe sort of more McDonald's-esque, but let's try them. So after a promising start, so I'm waiting for desserts. I really hope they're nice. I want to sort of ride that wave of momentum. We've got three Heymans. I've got a waffle coming and a shake coming. If one of those can get a Heyman, I would be ecstatic. Um, I love giving you guys recommendations of places that you should try rather than having negative videos of places you shouldn't try. It just makes me really happy to give people positive recommendations. So, so yeah, excited for uh, dessert. Okay, so we're starting actually with a Biscoff uh, waffle and also I've got a Kinder Shake. One thing to note actually is with the Biscoff waffle, it comes with Biscoff crumb, there's some Biscoff sauce on there. However, you can actually for a pound, which is what I've done today, I've actually added another topping. I thought I'd add strawberries. I love the acidity of strawberries. I think strawberries and chocolate go really well. I feel the acidity from the strawberries and chocolate's quite sort of indulgent. I just think they, they work. So I'm hoping it goes well with Biscoff as well. Never had it before, so don't know. <laughs> but it's a quid for a topping, so I thought, why not? Also, I've got a Kinder shake here as well. Let me go for this waffle first. Like I said, man, the heroics from the mains, the burgers are so good. I'm looking forward to this. I'm liking the Biscoff and strawberry. I think that actually goes well. Also, as far as waffles go, perfectly serviceable. It's a decent waffle, it's tasty. I don't think it quite matches how amazing the burgers were, but honestly, if I was getting burgers with me, I probably would get a waffle because all in one, a fancy dessert, why not? <laughs> right, so I actually thought I'd pop outside to actually have the shake, have a little walk with you guys. Glossop is lovely, I'm liking the area, I can see the uh, the hills, I think they're the peaks actually. Uh, are they the peaks? I'm not good at geography. I feel like that's the peak district, I don't know. Uh, in the distance, looking lovely. So yeah, my thoughts on that place, guys, the mains were unreal. I would highly, highly recommend you try these guys out. I'll put their details in the description. Highly, highly recommend you try them out. I thought the actual waffle was decent as well, perfectly serviceable, but let me try the actual shake. Mm. Oh, that's good. I'm not even a shake fan. The Kinder Bueno shake, the Kinder Bueno comes through nicely. It's a thick shake, but not too thick. Not so thick that you have an aneurysm trying to suck out all the milk, you know? So, you know what? I think I would get the spicy burger, the patty, like the smashed patty burger, and the mitt. I'm just saying all the burgers. The, all the burgers are good, and I would get that for sure. And if you like waffles, you fancy one, that's pretty good as well. I'm not sure if you can hear in the background this chap saying, free up my G. I'm not quite sure who my G is to free up, but there you go. <laughs> but yeah, overall, highly recommend these guys. 
do try them out let me know what you think guys if you've stayed by to the end thank you so much for staying by all the way to the end do drop the video a like really helps with exposure on youtube and yeah thank you so much again and i'll see you guys in that next video bye 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 bye